Well, our program is a traditional program in that it provides outstanding opportunities to develop young clinicians and people that want to go into the field of internal medicine. We're here to prepare them to be outstanding researchers, outstanding hospitalists, outstanding fellows in whatever field they may be choosing to pursue. And the way we do that is through a somewhat tailored curriculum. So early on in their training, we try to identify residents with specific interests and pair them with mentors and some time and training to hone their skills to make sure they have opportunities to pursue what it is they're passionate about doing with this medicine residency training. I think we tend to underdose it, but I think your idea here. We try to have a program that is uh, collegial in every respect. Uh, we learn from each other. As far as camaraderie between you know, the residents, especially in my grade, the third years, I mean, we hang out, we're great friends, we hang out outside of, of residency. Well, the residents are well trained, so we have good guidance as interns. Um, the residents are phenomenal ahead of us, so I can't imagine what we'll be like next year. I'm sure we'll be just as great as they are. And the attendings, um, some of them are close to our age, so there's a good bonding environment with the attendings. They're not malignant at all. The amount of autonomy I feel like we, we are able to have, even as interns here, is just the right amount. So you feel like even from the get-go, you're making decisions, you're making clinical decisions. I, I don't feel the attendings micromanage very much, but they're always there to support you. So you get a fair amount of, of autonomy uh, early on, which is intimidating, but also empowering. It's okay to ask questions, and I feel like I learned very well in that nurturing environment, and I feel like anytime I need something from anybody, fellow or resident, that um, I don't have to hesitate to ask, and they'll help me in any way they need, and I learn a lot that way from it. It's easy to get to know all the residents, um, and you feel like they really have your back, and you don't get lost in a crowd here. I came here on interview day, I felt like I interviewed with family and it wasn't um, intimidating at all. It was family and friends and I felt welcomed and um, I left here thinking this is where I want to go. The location, Augusta, I think is a unique area in itself. Um, it drew me to the area too, having the masters here, it's a big thing in Augusta. Being two hours from the beach and two hours in the mountains, it's a good location. Um, that's a big strength thing, the location of the community itself. We do have you know, wonderful outdoor spaces, wonderful restaurants to go to, and if you give Augusta a chance, you'll see that it's a great place to live. It was the faculty um, that really um, made me want to stay here. Not only are they great educators, and they're here for us, it's, it's very evident that they're here to teach us. They could go other places and do other things, but they're here because they're interested in teaching, they're interested in education, um, and they're interested in helping um, residents. I think the faculty uh, are functionally residents because of the work that they're willing to do and the slack they're able to pick up if uh, times get busy. Um, uh, the faculty are fantastic to help out and are very involved. They not only you know track your academic progress, but they also help you pursue your career goals. They um, encourage you to submit case reports. They help you get in touch with people that can um, help you pursue clinical research projects or basic science research projects. There's various research opportunities and research projects that are available for the house staff. As a resident, I did a lot of um, um, research projects at the Cancer Center and was able to publish various papers in national journals and was able to present at a national conference. And We have uh, strong basic research, tr strong clinical research, and strong translational research. Okay. Uh, it's a great hospital. Matching Residence with the appropriate faculty members and mentors is, is, is one of the tasks that the faculty and I take very seriously. And we're actually pretty good at it. We have really a wide variety of research opportunities for those that are interested in research or maybe they don't know, or maybe they're just interested in learning. Certainly it's been my pleasure over the years to get this little window of time, a thousand days or so, with uh, three years of a residency program to really have an impact uh, on seeing people develop and blossom. We're a fantastic program. Uh, we have all the benefits of a large city program, but we still have that smaller, you know, feel, a good camaraderie. From the experiences that I've had at MCG as a student and as a resident so far, I feel that I've gained a lot from being here and uh, it's a great training program 
and I would encourage anybody that's interested in internal medicine to seriously take a look at MCG. We're looking for people with diverse interests, we're looking for diversity, we're looking for people to move our program forward. It's, it's, it's really been a, a satisfying experience to watch not only our program develop, but our individual residents uh, mature into fine physicians and really outstanding individuals that we're very proud of.